y'all it's halo rose welcome to my channel and today we are going hygiene shopping for the fall as you guys know the fall smells are way more warm as opposed to fruity and actually that's like my favorite type of scent i've never used this olay sugar and cocoa butter exfoliating moisturizing body wash oh my god i highly recommend this i might pick this up today the next thing that i see is this shea butter and brown sugar caress i just love the smell of it girl it's just it smells so good it's hard to describe it's a very warm type of scent of course now this one right here i never seen this one this is a cocoa butter and oat milk one and oh it is so pretty i would literally get this just because it looks so pretty to me that one smells good too, but girl, it does not smell better than the Shea Butter and Brown Sugar one. The Dove body washes are $6.97, and the fall ones I see is the Coconut and Cocoa Butter one, and they also have the Shea Butter one. They actually got a two-pack. Okay, guys, I do recommend this soft soap coconut butter scrub. Um, it's like a soap body wash and a scrub. And for this big one, it's only $5.88. If you guys seen my coconut and lime video, you know that I rave about this. This is the native body wash. It is coconut and vanilla. The smaller one is $8.97, which is 18 ounces. And the bigger one is $12.97, and that's 36 ounces. I recommend the bigger one for sure. Another one that I see that's probably gonna be really good for sensitive skin like mine is the St. Ives. It's oat milk and shea butter and it's 100% natural extracts. So the St. Ives body wash only retails at $3.97. Moving right along to the lotions. My favorite lotion is Jergens Ultra Healing. If you know, you know I've been using this since I was a little girl. My mama put me on, shout out to my mama. With me, my skin is so dry that usually I have to put on a lotion and then I have to put something like a body butter or oil over it so my skin can remain moisturized but with that you don't need to do all that I might try this one out right here it is the Jergens infused and rich shea butter if y'all know you know that this Queen Helene cocoa butter lotion this smells so good but I'm not gonna lie it is very watery and it's not moisturizing but I guess to combat that they have this body cream which is 488 no ma'am no ma'am that smells like petroleum jelly and I would not buy that but I would definitely get the cocoa butter lotion if you are a sucker for like this is like the staple this is like the best cocoa butter scent that I've ever smelled like for real Queen Helene staple OGs know about it if you don't know about it I just put you on for sure so I also see Palmer's has a cocoa butter formula and I've tried this before I highly recommend it smells very good as well and actually I feel like these two mixed together is going to be the best smell ever if you love the cocoa butter scent I want y'all to let me know if you ever tried any hemp lotion because I'm not sure why anybody would ever charge $19.48 for a lotion, but they have this pumpkin spice and vanilla chai. So if you tried these hemp lotions before, let me know because I guess hemp is supposed to make you relax, but I'm not, I don't know. I'm not sold on paying $20 for a lotion. Now I see that the Vaseline brand has this like baby oil gel i usually get the johnson and johnson one but vaseline has one as well it retails at 648 and usually what i do is i put lotion on and then i'll follow it up with something like this okay so guys i never tried body ecology but they have a cozy fireside s'more scent and I've never even heard of a s'more scent, but that's different. It smells yummy. It definitely smells yummy. So they have the spray, which is 
$3.97. They have the body cream, which is $3.97. And then they have the body wash as well. I'm about done at Walmart, so we just finna head to the crib and I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. Okay, y'all, so I finally made it back home and I'm excited to share the new finds that I found for fall feminine hygiene products. So let's just go ahead and start off with the body wash. I decided to go ahead and pick up this Caress Shea Butter and Brown Sugar Body Wash. I used this a long time ago. My best friend put me on. It smells so good. So good. And when you're pouring it on your towel or a loofah, it pours like liquid gold because it has sparkles, like gold sparkles all in the body wash. And once you pour it and then you smell it and start washing up with it i swear you're gonna be feeling like queen of the world like you're royalty like it's definitely giving that vibe along with the fall vibe so i highly do recommend this okay so moving right along to the bar soaps i did decide to go ahead and try out the dove shea butter bar soap usually what i do is i wash up before my pre-wash up with antibacterial soap and usually that strips your skin and so i always like to follow up with a moisturizing bar soap and dove has some really really good scents and this one is definitely giving the fall vibes so it's shea butter and vanilla and i'm very excited to use this i did also get a chance to stop by dollar tree and don't sleep on dollar tree when it comes down to feminine hygiene products because they do have a lot of name brand products as well so i picked up two yardly bar soaps one is oatmeal and almond and the other one is shea and buttermilk and i never tried yardly before but these both smell really good and it was only a dollar 25 so i decided to go ahead and pick those up all right moving right along to the scrubs this right here in particular is by dove it is an exfoliating body polish it is brown sugar and cocoa butter and of course smells good they all have the warm vanilla cocoa butter fall types of vibe scents but this product is very very good because i have the mango butter one and the consistency is very moisturizing as well as exfoliating and that's what i absolutely love about it i seen another youtuber rave about it she said this is a staple in her hygiene routine and she's been using it for years so when i seen it at target and walmart i knew i had to get it because it's not something that i see all the time this particular scent okay so this next product i'm probably the most excited to try is by the dead sea collection and it's coconut moisturizing and nourishing mineral salt scrub and i'm excited to try this because people travel all throughout the world to go to the dead sea to like wash up in the water they claim it does something amazing to your skin i think the dead sea is actually in the mediterranean if i'm not mistaken but if they got some type of collection some type of scrub i'm definitely down to try it out the last scrub i have is going to be the dr till's shea sugar scrub shea butter and almond oil and i did not know dr teals makes scrubs this must be something new but i'm here for it so this has shea butter sweet almond oil and macadamia seed oil in it and this is my first time trying dr teals scrub so it smells really good and it looks like it is very exfoliating as well if you guys have tried any of the other dr till scrubs let me know how you guys liked it and what scents you guys got okay so last but not least we are going to go into the moisturizer so the first thing that i picked up was this jergens enriching shea butter lotion I love Jergens. I have the ultra healing lotion that I've been using since I was a child. It's the only lotion that really moisturized my skin to my liking. And I just can't wait to take a shower and put this on because it's a different smell than what I'm used to using, which is the ultra healing, which I love that smell as well. But it's nothing wrong with something new, something fresh. 
Okay, so this next lotion, not gonna lie, this is an OG Queen Helene Cocoa Butter Lotion. Now, anybody who knows knows that this lotion is not particularly something that is moisturizing, but for me, it smells so good. It reminds me of my childhood. It is one of the best cocoa butter scents that I've ever smelled. It smells so good that I got it anyway just for the scent. And what I do usually is I mix it with this Palmer's cocoa butter formula, which also smells really, really good. This is more like a butter and it's thick and it mixes and blends very well with this. Or I use this Johnson & Johnson shea butter cocoa butter baby oil gel and either one of those items mixed with this girl you are gonna smell so good you are gonna smell like so warm and just like a cookie and I don't know I'm just a big fan of the fall scent the cocoa butter the shea butter I just love it so those are all the things that I got this time around for my fall hygiene haul let me know if you guys have any suggestions down below i need to put some of these products together and take me a nice little shower bath routine for the fall and so definitely be looking out for that and i love you guys so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye Hope you're responsible. Oh, I'm not just here to cry. Is it my goal? Is it your goal? Sometimes I'm pretty good. I know I'm not enough. Say yes or say no. Cause I don't want to survive.